Melody puts $4,000 into its savings account with a 2% interest rate compounded annually. How many years will it take for this amount to double? Let's use the compound interest formula. The total amount needs to be 8,000, our principal is 4,000, our interest rate is 0.02, and it's compounded annually, so n equals one. We're looking to solve for t, so let's simplify what we have. We can divide by 4,000 on both sides, which is two on this side and cancels itself on this side. Then we are left with 1.02 to the t power. In order to solve for t, we're going to need to use some logarithm review. Let's use some easy numbers for now, like 45 equals two to the x power. In order to solve for x, I can take the log of both sides, so that log 45 equals log two to the x. If I have a base of two, then the inverse property will cancel this side out, so we're just left with x. Then we can rewrite log base two of 45 equals x. One more log rule to remember is the change of base rule, which means that this can be entered into a calculator as log of 45 divided by log of two, which equals some number, but you get the point. So let's get back to Melly's example. We left off with two equals 1.02 to the power of t. Using the same log rules from earlier, we can take the log of both sides so that log of two will equal log of 1.02 to the t power. And if we use the base of 1.02, this will cancel itself out. That means we are left with log base 1.02 of two equals t. Next, according to the change of base formula, log base 1.02 of two is equivalent to log two divided by log 1.02. After typing this into a calculator, we can round our answer to the nearest whole number to get 35. This means that it will take about 35 years for the money in Melody's savings account to double. Now that you know how to calculate using logarithms, I'm gonna show you a mental math shortcut to quickly compute compound interest problems. This will only work for select growth rates and if you're looking to double the initial amount, but still a cool way to compute quick estimates. Here's the shortcut. It's called the rule of 72. If you take the number 72 and divide by the growth rate, you'll get the number of years it will take to double the initial amount. Let's try it with melodies. 72 divided by our growth rate of 2% equals 36, which isn't exactly what we got, but actually is really, really close. Continue on to the next video to practice more logs and checking your answer using the rule of 72.